Thank you, Father Karski, Bishop Felton, Father Kelly, Reverend Fathers, beloved sisters, any other guests, and of course, my dear brothers. The priest that I chose to honor with this priest hero talk is Father Rafael Burcasio, or as he introduced himself to me, Father Rafael, not the angel. <laughs> I met Father Rafael three years ago for just about an hour um, during my spring break trip um, out to Arizona in a little church of El Cristo Rey on the south rim of the Grand Canyon. And I chose to fa honor Father Raphael with this talk because in the short time that I knew him, he spoke the truth and I saw in, a man, saw in him a man who found the pearl of great price that is the relationship with Jesus Christ and sold everything that he had to obtain it. So, fast, well, rewind three years ago on my trip, me and three seminarians uh, ar arrived at El Cristo Rey Church for Mass early one weekday morning. We walk into an empty church, and so we sit down, and the church is already prepared for Mass, so when Father Raphael enters, we all rise, and Father Raphael just made a beeline towards us. And he introduced to us, and he wanted to know who we were, because you have to understand, Father Raphael has a parish of 12 families, so, on weekdays, he's usually celebrating Mass by himself in the church. And we got to know him real quick before Mass, and we told him that we were seminarians. And it was then that he started to open up and talk brilliantly about his priesthood in both the time that we talked to him before, after, but also during his preaching. It was a homily directed straight towards us. And in that time, um, he was truthful about his struggles with loneliness being in such a small parish separated from his brother priests and having such a small congregation to minister to. But he also expressed his deep love for the Lord and you could tell that he was rooted in that love and that relationship with Christ and he would do anything for the Lord. And so, um, as he admitted to that assignment, not being one for younger priests, uh, newly ordained, he said, um, he did find great joy in it because he was rooted in Christ. And we all know Rim here very well, that the relationship with Christ comes first. And he found great joy in ministering to the wayward souls that come and find his parish on the south rim of the Grand Canyon. And he showed us great love and encouraged us, encouraged us on in our vocations. And it was from Father Raphael that I learned how beautiful but how hard the vocation that I was discerning actually could be. And I didn't know it at the time, but Father Raphael had a great impact on my vocation. And it's because of him that I saw that pearl of great price for myself. And I saw the beauty, the love, and the suffering that it can contain. And I knew that it was worth it and that I was going to offer everything I had to obtain it myself. And for that, I'm forever grateful for Father Raphael, not the angel. And I can confidently say, praise be Jesus Christ. Amen.